guys and welcome to our channel. We are Anna and Edward or Two Curly Heads Wandering. In this episode we are going to explore the beautiful city of Oxford where various scenes from Harry Potter were filmed. So stay with us and enjoy the ride. Welcome to Oxford, a city where history comes alive and culture thrives at every corner. Join us as we embark on a journey through the cobblestone streets and ancient colleges of this timeless city. Founded over a thousand years ago, Oxford is renowned worldwide as a center of academic excellence. Home to the prestigious University of Oxford, this city has educated some of the greatest minds in history. The colleges of Oxford exude greatness and tradition with their breathtaking architecture and picturesque courtyards. Each college has its own unique history and charm, offering a glimpse into centuries of scholarly pursuit. The Bodleian Library, with its vast collection of ancient manuscripts and rare books, is a treasure trove for scholars and bibliophiles alike. Meanwhile, the Radcliffe camera stands as a symbol of Oxford intellectual heritage. Its dome is dominating the city skyline. We didn't have the chance to go inside the library, but we have found another way to admire it even more. For six pounds per person and after climbing the 127 steps you can admire the library and the rest of the city from the tower of the University Church of St. Mary the Virgin. This tower offers you stunning views over the most iconic buildings in Oxford for a very affordable price. Our next stop was Carfax Tower. It is all that remained of the 12th century St. Martin's Church, which was demolished in 1896 to make way for road improvements. For £4 only per person, you can climb the 99 steps to reach the view platform and enjoy stunning views of the city. Beyond Academia, Oxford pulsates with a vibrant cultural scene. From lively markets and quaint cafes to world-class museums and theatres, there's something here for everyone to enjoy. This outfit was perfect for our next location, the Bridge of Sights in Oxford, also known as Hereford Bridge. It's a famous pedestrian bridge that connects two parts of Hereford College over New College Lane. It was completed in 1914 and it's known for its striking resemblance to the Bridge of Sights in Venice, although it's on a smaller scale.
It's Oxford City, Harry Potter's home. Well, no, Oxford City is not the home of Harry Potter. However, some of the filming locations for the Harry Potter movies are in Oxford. Various scenes from the Harry Potter films were filmed in Oxford University's Christ Church College, including the Great Hall, which served as an inspiration for Hogwarts' Great Hall. Entrance at the Christ Church College was £20 per person and it's worth it. The Great Hall was built between 1529 and 1532 during the reign of King Henry VIII. The Great Hall is still used for dining. It serves as the main dining hall for students and fellows of the college. Additionally, the hall is occasionally used for special events, formal dinners and other gatherings, maintaining its role as a central hub of social and academic life within the college community. I can't imagine how special it must be to have dinner here. I love this music. <laughs> I really love the organ music because of the Hunchback of Notre Dame or because of the Beethoven music as well. I love it because it's gothic, it's strong, it's powerful. And here the organ at Christ Church is a notable instrument, adding to the rich musical tradition of the college and enhancing the worship experience for those attending the service. If you'd like to visit Oxford, we will recommend you to have at least two days in order to see as many things as you can. If we can make a comparison between Cambridge and Oxford, we must say that we loved more Oxford. Because the city is airy, multicultural and energetic. 
Cambridge on the other side. It's a little smaller and having the conglomerated locations in a rather small space. Oxford architecture is a fascinating blend of styles spanning centuries. Gothic, Baroque, Georgian and Victorian influences coexist harmoniously, creating a visually captivating landscape that reflects Oxford's status as a centre of learning and culture, whether wandering down narrow lines with timber frames, houses or marvelling at the grandeur of Radcliffe Square. Every corner of Oxford offers a glimpse into architectural tapestry. Ah, now. Ah, okay. Now, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Fresh. Fresh, man. Fresh, Fresh. Fresh. yes. <laughs> one and uh, one. One, yes, please. Okay, take away or in? Take away. Take away, okay? Take away. Fresh. Thank you for watching and if you like our videos please subscribe to our channel see you in the next video take care